How is it going guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we are going to be reacting to the 5 impossible things that could happen on different planets. Let's go. There are some things that are just not possible on our planet. It would certainly be understandable that you would think that if yep. it's impossible Pigs here flying. on Earth, then it would be impossible everywhere else in the universe. But that's simply not the case, and the universe is far stranger than any of us can actually believe. Let's begin with shadows. Your shadow on Earth is always yeah. alone, and you're always used to seeing it this way as it follows you around during the day. You're yes. also used to seeing everybody else with just one shadow, <clears throat> but this isn't a universal thing that would be experienced elsewhere. You have one shadow because our primary light source on Earth is our sun. But what would happen if there were two suns? A two planet shadows. that orbits two stars would look wow. much like Tatooine from Star Wars, yeah. with two brilliant sunsets each day and two shadows instead of one for each person. It used wow. to only be science fiction until the planet Kepler 16b was discovered, which is a Kepler place that orbits two B. different stars. What a name. If you were suddenly teleported to the surface of the planet, you would likely die from the extreme temperatures and lack of air yeah. to breathe. But assuming that you were teleported in a suit that could help you survive, then you would experience having two different shadows. A friend for I mean, your always lonely shadow that you... I, I, I would prefer having a single shadow than going there and dying because of heat. Experience but, yeah, on Earth. It's cool. Our next having two shadows. bizarre place is a planet that is likely completely covered in water, an ocean planet named GJ 1214b. The wow. planet is several times who, who, larger. Who than names Earth, these which... planets? Like, who comes up with GJ 1214b? Like, it's such a long thing to remember. Like, name it Bob or. or jack or something makes the pacific ocean on our planet seem like a puddle in comparison even though oh. water covers over 70 percent of the earth's surface water only accounts for 0.05 percent of the earth's total what? mass on gj 1214b 0.05 for up to 10 percent of the planet's 10 percent of mass is that the entire planet would be covered in an ocean hundreds of kilometers deep our own ocean goes down only a mere 11 kilometers, and we already have nah. terrifying monsters like this. And uh, this uh, uh, look at look at this. Terrifying uh, monsters like look this. Look at look at that. Is that even a living thing, or is it just a stone formation? And this, or, uh, uh, or huge uh, whales like this. So, one's imagination can run absolutely uh, wild with what fantastical monsters could exist in a ocean that's over 10 times deeper than our own. Imagine. Who knows what could be lurking there if you crash landed your ship on the surface, but what is known is that at the very bottom of this massive ocean, hundreds of kilometers beneath the surface, the pressure would be so intense that the water at the bottom would be transformed into an exotic form of ice known as Ice 7. This ice, ice wouldn't seven. be like ice that you know on Earth. It wouldn't be cold at all, but would remain in a solid form. This doesn't happen naturally on Earth, but neither does our next bizarre example. Weather on Earth is often violent and unpredictable, but it's extremely tame compared to other places in the universe. Take the yeah. planet COROT7b, for example, 7B. where instead of raining water, it rains down rocks. This is because half of the planet is scorching hot at 2,600 degrees Celsius. <sighs> okay, it is hot. But how does it rain rocks instead of water? While the other half is far cooler at 177 degrees yeah, Celsius. Yeah, 177 degrees the is cool. On the hot side is enough to vaporize rocks. And just like how water will evaporate and condense into clouds on Earth, so too will rocks, rocks evaporate and into rock form rock clouds. On this wow. Planet. These strange rock clouds will then rain liquid rock or magma back liquid onto rock. the surface. But since the atmosphere is cooler the further up it goes, and the temperature on the cool side is far lower, the so when it falls down, it turns into solid into rocks. Rocks. Striking wow. The ground. This planet what? seems like the closest place to hell that a place in the universe <laughs> could get, but another planet has perhaps even more bizarre even weather. Bizarre. This planet, known as HD 18977B, yeah. is located 63 light years 4K. away from us, is a little larger than Jupiter, and looks stunningly beautiful from space. But okay. that beauty is hiding a terrifying secret. Ooh. It looks this way because the planet's atmosphere is made up primarily of silicate particles. 
Winds on the planet can scream at 5,400 miles per hour, equal to two kilometers every two second, kilometers or seven sec times the speed of seven. sound. Temperatures can soar up to 930 degrees Celsius, wow. but most terrifying of all is that the planet rains glass R sideways in its sideways. extremely violent two kilometer per second winds. Oh, imagine pieces of glass coming at you at two kilometers per second speed. You're done for. E e even if you are Iron Man, the glass will cut through the iron. This is so fast what? and scary that if a storm like that happened to appear on Earth, it uh, would travel across we, we the gone. entire planet at the equator in just five hours and yeah. thirty-three minutes. It's, it's annihilation in five hours, a basically. Trail of glass. Yeah. But even this storm pales in comparison to the mightiest wind. Even so this far is not extreme. In our entire universe, the wind on the planet HD one eight nine seven. Another HD. B. This is a gas planet with one side always facing its star, where temperatures okay. can reach a scorching 966 degrees Celsius. It's but not the that temperature bad. on the dark side is still very hot at 688 degrees 600, Celsius. Bro. So, how does the dark side remain so hot still? The answer is extremely, wickedly fast wind, possibly up to 22,000 <laughs> miles per hour, equal to 10 kilometers per second, or nearly so the speed 29 of... times okay. the speed of sound. 29 times. The fastest the of ever sound. recorded wind on the Earth happened during a tornado in Oklahoma back in 1999, and that was only 301 miles per hour, oh, or 73 oh, times it's, it's less over. than the nightmare storm on this giant that's raging right now as you are watching this video. Wow. If you made yourself a kite and flew through the wind, no, no. then you could zip around the entire Earth in a mere one hour and eight one hour. minutes. But perhaps the most interesting place is somewhere that's much closer to home, specifically this place called Neptune? Titan, which is a Titan. moon of Saturn. Okay. It has such a thick atmosphere that we didn't even wow. know what its surface looked like until 2005, which if you're okay. curious, it looks like this. But Titan is a very like bizarre Mars. place. It has an atmosphere, rivers, and lakes, and it even rains like on Earth. Wow. But the temperature is a bone-shattering negative 179 Whoa. degrees Celsius, which is so cold that water is he as humans are so delicate even if the temperature is too hot or too less we we are done for rocks and the chemical methane exists in a liquid state. ice rocks the clouds rivers and lakes on the moon are made of methane which is the primary component of Whoa. natural gas yep. only 20 natural percent gas. of titan's surface has ever been mapped but it is estimated that in that region alone there is hundreds of times more natural gas and oil than is located on all of wow. earth there is so much wow. gas on Titan that it literally rains it. It's rains an oil tycoon's gas. dream, and maybe the best way to rains encourage oil. space travel is to let a few countries know about Titan. But even more strange, you could actually theoretically fly on Titan. The atmosphere wow. is thick enough and the gravity is weak enough that if you attached a pair of wings to your arms and made a running jump then you could actually flap around the moon like a bird, taking in all the alien sights of rivers wow. and lakes. Of course, you would That's need a amazing. suit to protect yourself, but still, yeah. you could fly just like in your wow. dreams and achieve something that's impossible. Imagine Earth had a place like that. Those are the five most unbelievable things, or those are the five most impossible things that could happen on other planets in the universe. I mean, those are just the planets that we know about. Imagine, just imagine. Anyway, I'm happy to be on Earth, happy to be safe. So uh, yeah, see you guys in the next video. Please make sure to like, subscribe and share and see you guys next time. Peace.